Over the last two years, the world of the military industry has been intensely talking about air defense systems developed by different countries around the world. The purchase of Russian S-400 systems from Turkey, seemed to be one of the main catalysts for this development. Also, we all read that the tension in the Gaza Strip has not subsided, neither now nor is it expected to happen in the coming years. There, in this area stands out the name of an excellent missile system. On this video, based on guidance, mobility, altitude and range, Diversus TV Military, will provide you with the top 5 surface-to-air missile systems in the world. At number 5. The Chinese HQ-9. The Hong Chi-9, HQ-9, is a People's Republic of China ground-based extended range, mobile air defense system development. This system, is designed to destroy enemy aircraft, cruise missiles, and helicopters, at all heights of their combat use, day and night in all weather conditions. HQ-9, is China's most advanced example of the third generation of anti-aircraft missile defense systems. It is characterized by high combat effectiveness, in a complex jamming environment, including with a massive use by the enemy of various means of air attack. Since its initial development in 1997, HQ-9 has undergone significant upgrades and spurred naval, anti-radiation, and export designated variants. Most land-based HQ-9 variants, can hit targets at ranges of up to 200 kilometers, and altitudes of up to 30,000 meters. While its single-shot kill probability is as high as 90% against airplanes, it may be much lower, about 30% against ballistic missiles. HQ-9 represents the backbone of the Chinese missile defense program, and its complicated lineage reflects the changing demands, and constraints of Chinese air defenses over time. At 4. The MIM-104 Pac-3 Patriot, MIM-104, is a long-range, all-altitude, all-weather air defense system to counter tactical ballistic missiles, cruise missiles and advanced aircraft. The MIM-104 Patriot Pac-3, is designed to cover large administrative and industrial centers naval and air bases from all existing means of air attack in the face of a strong electronic countermeasures of the enemy. Is capable of simultaneously detecting and identifying more than 100 air targets and continuously tracking 8 of them, preparing initial data for firing launching and pointing up to 3 missiles for each target. This new Pac-3 missile, has increased effectiveness against tactical ballistic and cruise missiles through the use of advanced hit-to-kill technology. Lockheed Martin is the primary contractor, with Raytheon as the system's integrator. The Pac-3 has a K a band millimeter wave seeker developed by Boeing. The missile guidance system enables target destruction through the kinetic energy released by hitting the target head-on. 16 Pac-3 missiles can be loaded on a launcher, compared to 4 Pac-2 missiles. At number 3, the SAMPT Complex. SAMPT Complex is designed for air defense of mechanized units, and marching troops, as well as air defense of important stationary objects. It's capable of defending from a massive attack of a wide class of air targets, such as tactical missiles, all types of aircraft, unmanned aerial vehicles in all weather conditions, even when the enemy uses various interference of high intensity. The SAMPT Launcher Vehicle is fitted with eight ready-to-fire missile containers mounted at the rear side of 8x8 truck chassis. Each missile can be salvo-fired from a single launcher in less than 10 seconds. This system, uses Aster 30 Block 1 missiles, which are equipped with a modified seeker, fuse, signal processing and a directional blast warhead where larger warhead fragments are directed towards the target. The Aster 30 missile, has a tandem first stage solid propellant booster motor, which is jettisoned after launch, and turnover and before the mid-course phase. This missile, uses inertial mid-course guidance correction, being transmitted via Arabelle multifunction radar's uplink data channel. The Aster 30, has the capability to intercept targets at altitudes from 50 meters to 20 kilometers. Against aircraft targets flying at altitudes above 3 kilometers, the maximum range of the Astra the SAMPT for the Italian Army will be mounted on Astra 8x8 transporter erector launcher trucks. In second, the David Sling. This extremely capable defense system, is an Israeli defense military system, developed jointly by Israeli defense contractor Rafael Advanced Defense Systems, and US defense contractor Raytheon. This system is designed to intercept enemy aircraft, unmanned aerial vehicles, 
tactical ballistic missiles, medium and long-range missiles and cruise missiles. The Sturmer missile, is designed to intercept a new generation of low-altitude tactical ballistic missiles, such as the Russian Iskander, and the Chinese DF-15, using onboard dual CCDIR shelters, to distinguish between the bait, and the actual missile warhead, in addition to tracking by Elta LM-2084 active electronically scanning an array of multi-mode radar. A multi-stage interceptor, consists of a solid fuel booster rocket engine, followed by an asymmetric jamming vehicle with advanced steering gear, for super maneuverability during the jamming stage. The three-pulse engine, provides additional acceleration, and maneuverability in the terminal phase. The Sling of David, is designed to strengthen the second level of Israel's theater of missile defense system. The name of David Sling, comes from the biblical story of David and Goliath. This will form one level of Israel's future multi-tier missile defense system that Israel is developing, which will also include Arrow 2, Arrow 3 Iron Dome, Barak 8, and Iron Beam. David Sling was commissioned in April 2017. And finally at number 1, S-400 Triumph. The S-400 Triumph, NATO reporting name SA-21 Growler, is an air defense missile system, developed by Alamaz Central Design Bureau of Russia. The new system, replaced the S-300P, and S-200 air defense systems of the Russian Army. This air defense system, integrates a multi-function radar, autonomous detection, and targeting systems, anti-aircraft missile systems, launchers, and command and control center. It is capable of firing three types of missiles to create a layer defense. It can engage all types of aerial targets, including aircraft, unmanned aerial vehicles, and ballistic and cruise missiles, within the range of 400 km at an altitude of up to 30 km. The system can simultaneously engage 36 targets. The 40N6 missile of the S-400, has a claimed range of 400 km, and uses active radar homing to intercept air targets at great distances. It can be launched against AWACS, J-STARS, EA-6B support jammers, and other high-value targets. The 55K6 e command and control system of the S-400 Triumph, is based on the Ural 532301 mobile command post vehicle. The radar can detect and track aircraft, rotorcraft, cruise missiles, guided missiles, drones and ballistic rockets within a distance of 600 km. It can simultaneously track up to 300 targets. Therefore, based on this docks and many more, it take the first spot on this list. These were the diversest TV top 5 surface-to-air defense systems of today. If you don't agree with our list, please, share your top 5 on the comments section below. Thank you for watching.